What's the hottest temperature that you think you could survive in? Have you ever heard of a wet bulb temperature? To be honest, I hadn't either. A wet bulb temperature is a measurement that combines air temperature and humidity. So if you ever heard the term dry heat, this is exactly the opposite of that and it's actually way more dangerous. Sweat is what normally cools us down, but when it's too hot and humid, sweat doesn't cool us down anymore, which can make us overheat. So scientists at Penn State University were trying to figure out what the maximum wet bulb temperature could be that humans could live in. A wet bulb temperature of 35 degrees Celsius or 95 degrees Fahrenheit and 100% humidity was too hot and humid for the human body to properly cool itself down. And even for a young, healthy person like myself, it would be totally fatal after just six hours. Has the Earth ever hit a wet bulb temperature that high before? Well, yes, it actually has, but only a few times in places like the Persian Gulf, and importantly, never for more than six hours straight. As our Earth continues to heat up, wet bulb temperatures are something that we're all gonna have to keep an eye on. 